I thought I would show you my latest device that is running on the official uh, Android TV OS. Uh, anyway, there's the store. But I'm not going to tell you which device it is until the very end. Uh, now, I think some of you, if you've been watching my videos, you know that I've ordered one of those uh, Exami Me uh, boxes. That's the latest box that will be running the Android TV OS. So, uh, but that is not this particular box. Now, live channels. Now this is using my HD Home Run Tuners. Now something really strange on this one, uh, I have two of the uh, tuners, the old one and the new one. Anyway, they just set up the, uh, the old one where it would work. And when I tuned in this channel, it is using my older HD Home Run Tuner, which is excellent. Don't know how I did it, but it did it. Here's the guide. Again, if you look, it's got the HD uh, emblem in the top left-hand corner. So it's getting the uh, guide data and the stream and all that from HD Home Run. So, okay, I just wanted to show you that. Again, you're going to try to guess which device it is that's running on this official Android box. Uh, Code SPMC works very well. HD Home Run works very well. Netflix, but on this particular box, is not working very well. Uh, go to settings. It is running Nougat. About. Version 7.0. Now, if you notice, the build date on here is September the 11th, or September the 11th, 2016. So that was four days ago that this particular uh, version was built. Okay, so I'm not sure what else uh, I can show you. I have not hooked up the uh, voice on this yet, so that is not working. I have not tried it. Uh, Now this particular app running under Kodi, it does not use uh, my older tuner for whatever reason, it uses my newer tuner, which it's supposed to do. But I was shocked to watch that it did use the older tuner using the uh, uh, live channels. It's maneuverable, uh, you, can, you can put it wherever you want. Once you get the okay, Again, this one is using my newer tuner, it's not using my older tuner. Ultimately, anybody can learn to do this. Sarah, and I think anybody can. Uh, Thanks so. Everybody's seen this part, so I won't bother you with that one. Metro, or excuse me, in Harrison Township, I should say. Rook, we're going to send it back to you in the studio, and I know I'm sure that. Uh... Okay, while you're guessing, while you're trying to guess what that is, uh, let me run one more here to give you one more clue to what it is. Manufacturer all winner, that's SOC, brand Android. CPU. Display, 1920 by 1080, it's HD display. Uh, Android. Subway Nougat, Subway Zero Nougat, that's what it's running. Kernel version is July 7th, 2016. 
So anyway, I will show you that and hang on just a minute and I will show you what device I'm running it on. Okay, now these are my official uh, Android TVOS devices. That one is the ADT-1. This is my Nexus player. And no, I am not running it on that. Uh, is it running on my Remix Mini? No. Is it running on my Transpart Micro PC? No. The R box? No. Transmart, another box. Is that running on that one? No. Hmm. Is it running on the X9? No. What is it running on of? U box? No. Ah, Pine 64. Somebody, or I should say that um, one of the developers, and his name is IU Fan on the Pine 64 forum, he ported the Android Nougat, Android TV, to this little Pine 64 board. Now, I don't know if you're familiar with how these boards work, but they use a micro SD that the, uh, uh, you put the OS on. Now, this particular one is the um, Linux, Ubuntu 16.4, whatever it is. That is my Linux. I put it in here. And this is a Linux machine. And right now, the little SD card I got in here now, that is the one that's running the Android TV OS. So, anyway, that is the developer box that you're watching, and you're actually seeing an actual Android TV OS running on that box. So now you know. Thank you.